some googling up in this mother huh okay let's let's look up some logan hall apparently this is trending okay what do we got here We got some hella shocking news for you. Okay, Clever News published this news bit on April the 3rd, 2018, regarding Logan Paul. He was in Yosemite for his 23rd birthday party, riding around with his friends in a very, very cool bus, which sounds pretty normal until you consider the fact that a park ranger noticed him and his friends strapping up tents to the top of his school bus, and in addition, they were all sitting in those tents while the bus was moving. The park ranger, of course, deemed it an illegal operation and gave Logan a citation where he will have to pay a small fine. The ranger continued to say that the stunt, quote, wasn't the smartest or safest thing to do. No shit. In fact, wasn't the smartest or safest thing to do would be a hell of an understatement like that. In fact, I think it's probably one of the dumbest and least safe person sort of things that they can I mean, seriously, what's dumb, stupid, it's not safe, it's pointless, man. Which is a 
equivalent to how much an NBA player makes a year on average, which is one million dollars a month. That's 12 million a year, people. And this guy was set for life before he started doing this shit. So imagine how fucked he is now. Imagine how fucked he is. Seriously, you deserve this, Logan Paul. No kidding. You did this shit, you thought you could get away with murder, and you got caught. So there. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to slam the Democrats that run these social media websites. Let's get started! Ladies and gentlemen, it has come to my attention that Twitter is trying to pull a Facebook. They're trying to stir up this liberal Weishaupton satanic agenda that the Democrats have been pushing for for so many decades now. And they're just doing everything they can to avoid being called out by Congress like Zuckerberg did when his company Facebook was investigated. And to all the people running Twitter right now who are behind this scheme, you've officially been caught red-handed. The game is over, the jig is up, the fix is in. Close the book, stick a fork in it, it is done. Also, newsflash, huh? You want a news flash? I'm gonna give you a news flash. Yeah. So YouTube is trying to be essentially Google, which makes a lot of sense since Google's on YouTube now since 2006, which is the year after YouTube was founded by a trio of ex-PayPal employees who wanted to make a site where anyone could share videos as long as it wasn't too edgy. Look how that turned out. Rest in peace, YouTube, 2005 to 2018. CNN did self to death, huh? How do you like I should also point out that Facebook has become a hotbed for illegal immigration advocates and libtards. I'll tell you why. Zuckerberg just recently got called out by Congress. There are various sources from Fox News to YouTube to Wikipedia that tell you this. I don't even have to show you a clip because I'm not going to risk having a copyright claim put on my video because obviously I don't need to. And why should I? And you know, come to think of it, I have a few copyright claims being claimed on my recent output lately on several of my videos, notably on episode 2 of Savage Level Mega Knoll and a season 3 episode of Spot the Liberal. Of course, I played the matches to each of these videos and they sounded nothing like the content for which the copyright claimer claimed was stolen. Let that one sink in. So yeah, Facebook has Zuckerberged itself to death and hit an iceberg on the Weishaupton Titanic. So people, you're welcome. What the actual fuck were you? I wasn't. YouTube secret uncovered! Now, what is YouTube's biggest secret? Oh yeah, I forgot. It's the part of the freaking Illuminati! That's the biggest secret YouTube's hide from us. Also, it's been a part of Google and it's been Google's fish since 2006, so...
that's, that's what they would buy and try. I don't know the deep talking. Yeah, that's that's what they Somebody make your money! That's what they Nobody really gives a shit about Kim Kardashian or PewDiePie, that's what they PewDiePie makes an even bigger mistake than a Sarah. That's another thing. Subject is secret. Jack bitched out because he's afraid of having a real job, afraid of not having millions of dollars, afraid of being a regular person. So he called out the man that made him. I lost respect for Jack and he will never get it back from me. I insult him because now I know his whole act is a load of bullshit. He's a fake nice guy, a fake friend, a fake YouTube personality. Like I said, he cares more about money and lifestyle than supporting no one is friend, but let me say it again, the man who made it. I don't care about PewDiePie, to be honest. I don't watch his videos, but you don't shit all over somebody who's got me where you are just so you can try to save your own ass. We have a saying for that where I'm from. We call that being fish made. Wait a minute! Jack said the guy never said PewDiePie jokes were bad. He was just saying that those jokes could lead into some trouble if a limit was reached. Why no lifers think that he backstabbed him when he just helped him? Jack is a good friend of Felix, well, I'll tell you what, Ainsley. I'm not used to taking sides, I'm better off being a neutralist, but in this case I'll make an exception. I'm going with you on this one, because you're absolutely right and you know exactly what's going on. Thanks, Ainsley. I might even subscribe to your channel. You know what? Yeah, well, let me go ahead and do that now. <laughs> what the fuck? I needed this. Thank you. <laughs> you know what I'm So boy. You know, I'm just gonna go ahead and do. This. I'm. I'm gonna do this. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is, this is just too much, man. I'm telling you. This guy is legit. I wonder why he doesn't have any more followers than he does. Right, because he's not within the algorithm or whatever? Ah, the hell with it. I don't, I don't care. And now for some actual talent! Meaning the shit that you came here to see. And I didn't. This guy's... Oh my god! Oh my god. What? What? Oh... Uh. This is the kind of shit you'd see on Animal Planet, now isn't it? OH MY GOD, IT'S ANIMAL PLANET! HOLY FUCK! Well, that doesn't surprise me, that doesn't, I mean shit, man. It's a freaking rodeo, you're either gonna get bucked off the bull before the 8 seconds pass, you're gonna ride the bull for 8 seconds, or you're gonna get bucked off the bull in 8 seconds, and you're possibly gonna get killed by said bull. The bull is 1600 pounds, buddy, he just ain't gonna win! What the hell, man? Christ almighty! Did you expect to come out of that unscathed? I wasn't. It's just... And that's what you realized. He done fucked up. And luckily for him, it would not be the last time. So... Yeah, his, his foot apparently... Oh, 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 oh shit. Serves him right. He was stupid enough to get on in the first place. Well, I don't know, man. The birds are coming! Jesus! 
Dancing with the Stars premiered as a TV show in 2005, not 2014, okay? Let's get that straight. Alright? Oh boy. Alright, please, guys. Oh, we can! We can premiere in 2005! Holy s! <laughs> Look at that! The picture gets much clearer after the 40 second mark. Yeah, you don't fucking say. You don't say. No shit. Let's, let's get the point. Uh. That's supposed to be Chaz Bono, the same guy that used to be a woman named Chastity Bono, who was once Cher Bono's daughter, but transitioned into a man. Yeah, uh, good luck ever getting laid. Seriously? I won't name here, the following clip has of course been muted. 
because the copyright Nazis are everywhere. The front line is everywhere. Roll it. Yeah, this this looks good. I mean, I don't know, man. <laughs> this kid's trying to recreate the first successful bottle flip. <laughs> I don't even know. Oh god. Oh man, this is. I have a feeling this is actually gonna succeed. You know what? Let's just let's just assume I haven't seen this before, right? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh boy, here we go. Uh oh. Oh shit. Such an epic <laughs> Oh man. Oh golly. It's time for another episode of This Guy Cannot Sing. Oh Lord. <laughs> so that you see an audition process of working on Oh my god. With no chance in hell of ever getting laid. So neither do I, so there. You show it right. Anyway, I mean, seriously, check this last one. Seriously, let's go. Minecraft is here we go. Wait a second. Did I not see this before? Eh, the hell with it. And we leave you now with this clip of a wheelchair user playing for and winning, shockingly, a treadmill. <laughs> Go ahead and roll that shit. Make it, it's gonna make a difference, but he cares. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Yeah. But you'd never get up here, man. No shit. No shit. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Good night, everybody.